I'd like to invite Drew, go ahead and get that out of your system get it over with I'd like to invite to the ring two individuals who have had a profound impact on my life recently I'd like to invite to the ring Zach Gowan and my daughter Stephanie McMahon well a profound impact I'd say this about though, Cole. Well, Mr. McMahon is embarrassed, he's humiliated his kid Zach Gowan, cheating to win that arm wrestling matchup. Have Sable lead Zach Gowan on last week. And what about Stephanie McMahon, the general manager of SmackDown, who says she believes in Zach Gowan? That Zach Gowan is the last hope in Stephanie McMahon's life. The good of the world is in Zach Gowan. And Stephanie, well, very, very upset with her father's actions, she told Mr. McMahon that last week. I'm just surprised Mr. McMahon is calling both Zach and our general manager and Mr. McMahon's daughter, Stephanie McMahon, out here. I, I... I'd like to thank the two of you for joining me out here. Stephanie, I'd like to start with you, if you don't mind. Steph, I... I feel that last week your comments of scorn, well, they're still ringing in my ears. But I'd like to state this, that, that you have always been the apple of my eye. You always have been. You've always been daddy's little girl. And you always will. I'm trying to have a conversation with my daughter. This doesn't include any of you people, please. Okay? I'm trying to say something to my daughter. So, even when you were just a little girl and you had that, that cute little Dorothy Hamill haircut, remember that? I mean, you were absolutely precious. And then you kind of grew up on me very quickly. You matured very quickly, yes. And, and I admit, when, uh, when you were 17, I, I admit now that I asked you to close certain business deals for me, and, or at least to help me, and, and you did. And uh, I didn't realize at the time really what I had done. I didn't realize it till last week. And some would say I'm immoral, others may say I'm Amoral. I, I, I don't really know except that I realize now what I truly did, Stephanie. I stole something from you, Stephanie. I stole something from you. I stole your innocence from you, Stephanie. And it's almost as if, it's almost as if I even though I didn't, it's almost as if I personally deflowered you. And even though, since you're just like me, even though you, you may be able to forgive me, and I, and I hope you can, I'll never forgive myself for what I did. I'll never forgive myself. Which, which brings me to you, Zach Allen. Because just as I've learned something about myself from last week, I've learned something about myself as it relates to you as well. And it's real simple. 
and have finally figured it out, and it's this. I want to be Zach Gowan. And as strange as that may sound to you, it's true. But I'm Vince McMahon. Hell, I've done everything that anyone can possibly do. I'm a freaking billionaire. But I haven't done what you've done. You see, what you've done is you, you look death in the eye and you spit right in her face. That's what you've done. Yeah. I admire that. That takes courage. And as you stand here before this august crowd in Madison Square Garden on one leg, I admire that, Zach Allen. I've tilted windmills, but by God, I've never been Zach Gowan. I want to be Zach Gowan.